Grandma's birthday. We need to get her something so special from all of us. Well, does anybody have any ideas? Well, a flower bouquet. Yeah, she would like that, but maybe something more special from each of us. What about a custom picture magnet from each of us? Uh, wow, Antonio, that's very specific. I like my bouquet idea better. Caboodle fans, today we are gonna be creating some Encanto glass magnet. We're gonna need some glass kombanchons, lots of fun Encanto images. I've got a bunch of stickers and just some cutouts that I have. If you wanna use solid colors, you can also get some construction paper and this water-based glue. This is gonna help the images stick to the glass and then the magnets too. Let's get started. Let's pull these out. Now these kabanchans, they look like drops of water. They're smooth, they have round edges. These are gonna be perfect for our craft today because it's gonna really pop our image out. So we have Louisa, Mirabelle, Isabella and Antonio. And let's also get the magnets. Whoa, they're definitely strong. So we need four magnets. You're also gonna need either a cutout or some scissors. I've got the circle one and this makes life so much easier. Next, we're gonna pick out some images. Let me look at these. We're gonna bring our circle cut out and we're gonna start cutting these out in these circles. So I'm gonna do Antonio right here and I'm just gonna line it up so we can cut out his face. All right, let's go ahead and press that and let's see if it turned out. We kind of missed his hair there. I'm gonna cut this one of Mirabelle and I'm gonna put it in there and just line it up. Hopefully that would work. Let's take a look. Oh, this one is perfect for Mirabelle. I'm gonna do the same thing to Louisa and go ahead and stamp her head. Hopefully she'll turn out too. Perfect. This one's gonna go perfect for Antonio's magnet. Put it right in the middle. Go ahead and stamp. Oh, I think we took his face off. Let's see, yep, we can only see his eyes. Oh, yay, perfect. It even has like his name in the picture. Isabella, I'm gonna do this one because it has a bunch of flowers on this one. I think this one's gonna turn out. Beautiful Isabella. Now we have all of the characters. I won't be using this one or this one. So we've got four of them, awesome. Up next comes our water-based glue. Now you need a very liquidy glue for this to work so it's not so thick. And the pictures are really gonna show up on here. Let's do Louisa first. What you wanna do is you put a small amount of glue. I mean, that's all you pretty much need. You wanna grab your glass kabanchan and put it right in the middle and the glue should spread around it. How cool does that look? And if it slides a little bit, just go ahead and fix it until it becomes sticky enough for you to leave it to dry. Let's do Mirabelle's. So just a little bit amount of glue. <laughs> that looks funny on her nose. Grab your glass kabanchan and put it right on there. And go ahead and press it so the glue spreads out on the whole entire image. And I like it how this cutter is the same size as the glass. So whatever you cut, it's gonna work perfectly. We've got two images left. Let's do both of them. A little glue there and for Isabella. Here we go. Go ahead and press that and on this one. It really pops their faces because these are rounded. Now go ahead and let these dry before you put your magnets on. Our right, Caboodle fans, I'm creating more characters. We've got Bruno, Abuela, Alma, and then I created some more. So we'll have kind of like the whole entire family. We've got Julieta, Camilo, Dolores. Let's go ahead and put these on. These are gonna look so cool all together. So I stamped two more. Here's Peppa, I couldn't find a bigger one of her. And then of course, we've got Mirabelle's dad. What's his name? I think these are our last two. They're really gonna pop. Look at his face now. And Peppa's. I think we have the whole Madrigal family. How awesome would it be to do these capybara? This is Chispy, I believe. We need to do a magnet of this one too. Okay, I hope I got his face. Perfect. Get it out of there. This is like the cutest pet ever. 
Here we go, let's see it pop. Oh my goodness, adorableness. Now let's arrange them in order. Well, we wait until they dry, so I gotta be really careful. Okay, so we've got Grandma Alma. She's at the top right here. She had triplets, which includes Bruno, Julieta, and Peppa. Then we have Mirabelle, her sister Isabella, and her other sister Louisa. And we for this is Mirabelle's dad. We'll put him up here. We'll slide these. Then we have Antonio. He's one of the cousins. Same thing with Dolores and Camilo. Those are cousins too. So here are all the kids. And we are missing some spouses. Caboodle fans, what do you think about these glass magnets that we created? So once the glass is dried on each of the pictures, go ahead and grab each magnet. And now you can start gluing them on the back. So just a little bit goes a long way, you guys. And you don't have to use that liquidy glue. It's just what I have on hand right now. All right, now that the magnets have dried, we can go ahead and put them on something magnetic like the fridge. All right, Caboodle fans, how fun were these to make? Thank you all so much for watching. And of course, as always, stay sweet.